tool for you to remember the signs and symptoms is stressed. Because remember, cortisol is released in response to stress. So S, skin heals very slowly, so they are at higher risk for infection. Their skin is thinner, they bruise easily. T, they have what's called trunkal obesity with thin arms. So their midsection is heavy, they're bigger in the middle, but they have very skinny, skinny arms. R is for round face. Sometimes they refer to that as a moon face appearance. Also, reproductive issues. In women who have this, they may experience amenorrhea, so lack of menstruation. For men, um, when it comes to reproductive issues, erectile dysfunction, edema, and electrolyte imbalances, specifically low potassium levels, so hypokalemia. Their sugars are elevated, so hyperglycemia. They have striae, which are stretch marks, and they appear purplish in color. E is for extra hair on the body, especially in women. A woman who has Cushing's will start to develop some more like traditional male physical characteristics like excessive body hair. And then D is for dorsocervical fat. Sometimes they refer to that as a buffalo hump on their back. So it's an area of fat that gets collected. And then the final D is depression. So we have a lot of physical signs and symptoms, but we also want to address their mental state. And depression is a potential thing that could happen to a patient who has Cushing's.